hello guys welcome to dtw math plus okay so um i got this question posted by farah on our ged study math group on facebook okay so um this is what i'm going to be doing you know anyone any questions you have when you upload them on the facebook ged math group i will do a video explaining it okay not just um a text written explanation but an actual video explaining it and i'm also going to post that video on the ged math plus um, youtube channel okay so please don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel and also join our ged math uh, facebook group okay and i'm going to drop the link to the facebook group in this video and also uh you can try to support us by buying um the kaplan ged 2019 textbook um through our amazon affiliate link and also your ged calculator that's the texas scientific calculator you're going to be using for your gd maths you can also buy it through our amazon uh affiliate link to support you in preparing for your forthcoming GED exams and definitely there are several videos on this channel that will also support you to for your GED test okay so this question says the data represents the number of cars that the sales staff that the sales staff at Templeton Motors sold this week okay so these numbers okay this was what the sales staff when you see sales staff, that means that there are about how many sales staff? Let's just say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so 12 sales staff sold the amount, this amount of motors, what, this week. Now, the question says, which line plot correctly displays the data? All right, okay, we have option A, B, C, and D. Okay, let us, let us do this together. All right, so we have a... Okay, let me draw a straight line here. So we have our line plot. Sorry, it's not too straight. Okay, let's just say we have our line plot this way, and we have uh, we have zero here, we have one here, we have two, we have three, we have four, we have five, we have six, we have seven. Okay, I think I need to erase this. Okay, we have eight. We have 9 here, then finally we have 10, okay? Now, the first uh, sales uh, staff sold 4, so we're going to put a star under 4 here, okay? It sold 4 cars. The second sold 7, okay? We put another star here, 7. The third sold 6, we'll put a star under 6, okay? The fourth sold 8, I will have a star here. Then the fifth sold three cars. Then uh, the sixth uh, sales staff sold five. We have it here. Okay. Then the seventh. Okay, that's the seventh. Yes. The seventh sold four. Okay, so we have another sales uh, staff that sold four. So we'll put another star here on the four. Then the eighth sold three. We have another one that sold three, so we'll put it here. And uh, the ninth sold what? A uh, four. So we have another sales staff that sold four cars. That's this week. That's what the question said. All right. Then the tenth sold uh, five cars. So we have another person that sold five cars. Then we have an, another, the, the eleven sold two. So we have under here two. Then finally, the twelfth sales, sales staff sold three. So we have it here okay on that three so this is our answer all right so from here it'll be easy for us to get um, the total amount of cars by just saying uh three times you know three uh three staffs so three cars each so this would be just three times three that's if the question asks you but this is the way our line plot would display what this what data okay and what's the right option here okay this is similar to this here so our right option is option a okay so this is our right answer here all right thank you for staying tuned to this video don't forget to click the subscribe button subscribe to this youtube channel help us to grow and also join the facebook group post your questions that you find difficult with and definitely i'll do a video for you and upload on the group and also on youtube okay thank you don't forget to support us through our amazon affiliate link also and don't forget finally jesus christ is coming soon 
give your life to Christ, you are destined to win. Bye for now. See you in our next video. Thank you.